Okay, I am back. Hello. Sorry, I ate a piece of bread very fast. Because <laughs> I kind of needed to eat something, and I realized I forgot to cook everything. Whoops. I might need to order food at some point. We'll look into that. And let me turn. Camera back on. I'm zooming in right away, huh? One second. There we go. Okay. And let us continue. Okay. So we're going back to school again. <clears throat> All right. We don't have any money. Well, what is this fights place? We actually never went in here. stuff. Nice. I'm guessing this is furniture. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, wow. That's an expensive swan, though. $50,000 swan. Dang, I probably could have gotten that actually. I kind of want to check out this because it seems like optional spooky dungeon. Maybe I just can't do anything here yet. Off I one. Seems like they should be able to just go through, right? Okay, no fights. Yo! <laughs> Yo, thanks for the resub, and thanks for using your resub. I'm going to use this hamburger to shout out Room Russia for being extremely powerful at art. Thanks, Rum. Using it to shout out someone else. That's some high level shit. <laughs> That's that new stuff. <clears throat> Help, I'm addicted to Jimmy. Yo, I don't blame you. I'm also addicted to Jimmy. You might notice I've streamed it a couple times. <laughs> Once or twice. Once or twice, yeah. I usually am uh, more of a play a game once, kind of move on kind of guy when it comes to streaming because I like, you know, I'm a variety streamer. I like to live up to that. Also, you know, I don't want to pigeonhole myself into one game, you know. 
while I do envy the dudes who get, you know, 10,000 viewers at a time, I don't envy the fact that, you know, they can't play what they want. They 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 made a game their job now, you know. Right, like being a Fortnite only streamer that would uh that would get me real bad, yeah. <laughs> God, the VN music is so good. It is perfect shitty VN music. I love it. <laughs> As someone who, at one point, <clears throat> was part of a visual novel book club podcast for one season, exactly one season. <laughs> Did you hit your uh, visual novel limit? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. It was terrible. It was really, really bad. And it apparently was like one that was super highly regarded, and I'm like, well, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I even hold a candle to this one. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Yes. <clears throat> what? Okay, I think it's goon time. <laughs> nice. I'm glad you can get job levels during the VN part. <laughs> Yeah, that's sick. Yeah, it, it gives you, like, something to do to interact with it without making it, like, you know, something more than kind of the goof it is, you know? Not making it something you have to take super seriously and do all that. Oh. Alright, it's fight time. What can I grift? $800? $75? Hmm. <laughs> Give me the dollars, nerd. <laughs> oh, you know I'm stealing this money. Aw, oh, I managed to make Jimmy afraid. Mistake! <laughs> yeah! All right, 800 whole dollars. Hell yeah! It's free money, baby! <laughs> we take those! All right. Now to murder a nerd. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Lars just fucking <laughs> slammed a lady out of existence. <laughs> Pretty big hit. Welcome to high school. Yeah. Alright, it's time for bear murder. This is more or less how it would go if uh, actual RPG characters just decided to beat the hell out of a couple school children. <laughs> yeah. Got there. No, a spelling bee. <laughs> oh man, remember that time I stole eight hundred dollars from a kid? <laughs> <laughs> I fucking do. <laughs> Ty Tuesday remembers. <laughs> All right, let's go back to school. Also, I realize, sorry, you probably still have lines on your screen. There we go. <laughs> lines build character. Mm-hmm. We haven't been a flower in class yet. Do at least all of them once. <laughs> Virtual novel, pulsating mass. It's true. It's what it is. Virtual novel pulsating mass. <laughs> yes, he knows all this. <laughs> he asked me why I needed to take why I had to clean it at the exact same time he had to take a huge nasty shit and he said ah oh, it's the same time every day why then <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah, Jimmy's really good at math because his dad was like tutoring him through math. Lars, please. I know this is a dream, but you are still an old ass man. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Um I think Red Build Squawker is probably gonna be the most annoying to level, honestly. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna stick in bird form. It's smart. That's a way to think about President Garfield. <laughs> President Garfield presidential tass. trick in the world. Bear time. Bear party. <laughs> Man, you know what kicks ass? What? I wouldn't be able to do this. <laughs> I be able to, where's the preposition? I don't know, man. I just speak English for a living. How about you fuck off with asking me to deconstruct this sentence, man? Like, I don't give a fuck. I'll just say it good. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that people can understand me saying words at all is a testament to how unimportant <laughs> knowing this shit is. <laughs> <laughs> what, what happened to my wife? <laughs> All right. I'm just gonna guess that the spelling bee is going to be the end of the VN thing because that is, you know, it seems like a major problem for Jimmy is spelling, dyslexia, whatever. Yeah, especially how that uh, last cutscene was described. Yeah. <laughs> that is how a bear would be like hmm gravity you say I'm a pretty big bear I can do gravity
Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, is it Tommy a magical girl? Are you serious with this shit right now? <laughs> Looking at chat, just just reading. I do like that. Punch is just baffled by the concept of a magical girl. He's like, I don't get it, man. It's fucking wild. Like everybody just not mentioning the fact that he is a pulsating mass. <laughs> I mean, I guess that's the idea, though, is the pulsating mass is kind of something that's only really, like, to Jimmy, to everyone else, it's just kind of a strange undercurrent. No, it's more bear time. <laughs> Just bear stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Weird. <laughs> no, nah, it's bear party all the time. <laughs> Just bear stuff. <laughs> bear just caring about his heft. I kind of just always want to be a bear in school. <laughs> bear going to school is my favorite visual novel. <laughs> Jimmy's dad has a wife, but it's his actual wife. <laughs> yeah, exactly. He's, he's got... He's just living that two and a half D lifestyle. <laughs> <laughs> he's on that Klonoa... That Klonoa? Klonoa shit? Yeah, that two and a half D <laughs> shit. <laughs> That's that high level stuff. <laughs> so today the spelling bee... I think so. <laughs> Bear party. I see we've gone bearish percent in yeah. pursuit of the bear ending. <laughs> we went through everybody's normal stuff and now it's bear party. <laughs> what up, Loon? How's it going? 
pretty all right. Did you uh, see any of this in uh, Voice of Dogs playthrough of it? Yes. Okay. Uh, this caught me totally off guard, and I am, I am saying, yeah, holy shit, <laughs> wow. <laughs> Like, it's a really smart use of RPG Maker. It reminds me of how um, Proton John for uh, the Throne Controllers panels, he actually uses RPG Maker to, like, make the whole contest. <laughs> and I want to say it was, like, k -Head and Juker who did their thing too like they did like a trivia game kind of thing as well like i'm 40 <laughs> <laughs> Bear. <laughs> oh. Spelling. <laughs> yup. Jimmy's fear of failure and his dyslexia is that not great. <laughs> not great for a spelling bee situation. that good yes this is fine yeah this is fine this is normal okay that was magic so it didn't get countered the school bully turned out to be some sort of shadow demon disguised as a person that's normal that's normal i mean that's actually We're an anime it. dream that's what most high school bullies actually are <laughs> <laughs> also yeah bear no need magic when you have bear <laughs> Bear just slamming head first over and over. <laughs> Technically, that's the highest deeps, is all I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, the music in this game is extremely good. Yo, this music rules. Fuck. The power of Lars! Uh-huh. <laughs> yeah, that tracks. <laughs> so a moon warrior has followed us here. <laughs> I think Bear just took leftover damage or something. <laughs> also, holy shit, Space Jutsu? What? <laughs> <laughs> Resets cooldowns, eight turn cooldown, instant. Oh my god. Is Magical Girl, like, actually part of our party? Like, for... <laughs> for real style? Do 
These fists defend the universe. <laughs> yeah, I assumed it was only Hitomi's cooldowns, but still, that's being able to double fire is crazy. Especially because then if we give her like books with cooldowns, she'll be able to like double thermal bomb, for example. I don't get it. <laughs> Help. Huh? I'm I'm real dumb. <laughs> Help him like mad, stupid. <laughs> Jim Bugs Tanaka just immediately just Oh, is that Moon Warrior? Me. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. All right. I'm kind of busy doing janitor stuff. <laughs> All right. I may need to heal Jimmy at some point. <laughs> I'm kind of having like ultimate go ham nonstop. Rough house. God, punch rough house is nuts. Whoa. Okay. That's a move. Yeah, that's a two turn debuff on everybody too. All right, the game plan has changed. Yeah, you already undulated. Have you par like parallel? Yeah. And then unmotivated, I don't think affects magic. But I can call a shot. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good to know that is very real. I do like that though. No one knows what he really means when he says that. <laughs> yeah, we'll just go ham. Double damage rough house might be a good idea. Yeah. As I go for it. Oh, I wonder if that doesn't count. Maybe it's only regular attack. Oh man, barely got through that. Well, he was unmotivated, right? So it was cut in half and then doubled? Oh, right, probably. Yeah, I'll reflect for Jimmy. Okay, yeah, they don't have anything to do. Good counter. Nice! Ain't got the counter. <laughs> Good high roll. All right, I wonder if you're ever gonna get a chance to heal between fights. Yeah, I don't know. I'm kinda worried, so I probably I think I'm gonna pep talk here. So that's going to keep happening every time there's a fight as part of this sequence. Yeah, they do the level up that way. Yeah. <laughs> and then also the, like the, you know, the menacing songs might still be there for half a second and then, yep.
Oof, do I have to do all these encounters in a row? Oh, man. Uh, with these barriers. This seems bad. Oh, I have to go right into this, huh? It is checkpointed. Okay. If you get KO'd here, you can come right back to this fight. Okay. Okay, good. Because, yeah, coming in here already on the back foot is kind of... Mostly having my tank dead as I come in, kind of a problem. Yeah. Seems like there's a lot going here. on on the field right now, and it takes a moment to parse. Yeah. put together a really intricate battle and then the text speed is still too high to catch all of what's happening. Yeah, it's really hard to catch all the stuff they're saying. <laughs> That's mostly what I'm trying to figure out is which one does what. I think one of them was a reflect. That seems like the one I want to get rid of first. Because if I get rid of reflect, then I can at least, you know, do a spells. And I think that was E? Ooh, and that was a weak point, apparently. Okay, D. I think Lars put himself to sleep and got double damaged. Yeah, yeah, that's what it was, yeah. Still, though, survived. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so it's D is the one I need to get rid of. fight. And the last one giving alert is super rough. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, does the bat also have reflect? God, yeah, it seems like A, draining your energy is the worst. And then... D giving the barrier is also bad. Oh, he was weak pointed. That's what it was. Okay. So I guess D just also has reflect. Alright. That's a fight. Yep. And sadly, I can't do anything as far as equipping Hitomi. She just is what she is. It's a bummer. I mean, honestly, all I really need is to not just be on the back well, foot. Wait, since you bounced off of there, has she remained in your party, or...? No, no, she's not in here yet. Where was the fountain in here? How do I forget it? I don't really need it, but... <clears throat> what I do need in the hotel. is to make in sure this is optimal. Also, we might want to go into Jimmy mode again. Since Jimmy is actually OD. <laughs> kind of. Because uh, we get high five. We don't need clean getaway. We already have rampage. We already have fierce growl, which will be very good. This might be the fight where the cleanse is good. Uh, 
what were they getting us with? Just a bunch of debuffs. Can you like cleanse weak point. point off of someone? <clears throat> Can you cleanse weak point? I think it's only common. I don't think weak point is oh. considered a common one. Yeah, I don't think that works, unfortunately. Leech is probably good to have, but we have that as well. Maybe combust for once you've opened them up? Yeah. I mean, the thing is, we'll probably be using Fierce Growl, because that's even better. Uh, because we have 150%, because we have 50% attack. I say take the cleanse because no other reason that we just can't find anything better. Uh, bully. I mean, bully's cheap physical. We can go with that. Alright. <clears throat> Alright. Strictly better. Uh, I don't really need the stealing stuff. Better defense could be good. Yeah, general stats. We need crush instead, because <clears throat> that seems good. Can Lars learn Thermal Bomb? His magic attack is kind of butt cheeks, though. Crush is probably more useful, honestly. Yeah, we probably want fish knife now because we're going like really physical heavy. Give him the fish knife. Yep. guessing it's the physical protect one. Oh, wow! And I was weak pointed, so it did more. Okay, that's good to know that that is a very real counter. I cannot start with AoEs until I get rid of the AoE guys. As you might expect, when they threw this many targets boss right on the table. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it tracks. Alright. Dang, I almost just want to fall down and <laughs> start over now that I know the rules a little better. Looks like they have low enough HP that uh, you can probably single target down once a turn. Yeah. Yeah, you managed to take out one of them in the first attempts. Yeah. Yeah, this time they just went fucking hog wild. <laughs> as well as everything else. They went wild and yeah, you get a bunch of counter damage. <laughs> yeah, no, this is a very mother inspired game. I just got here. What mother is this? So I think single target bear should be able to knock one down, likely. Probably. Just leads the question of which one. one. Yeah, Chad, I have a save right before the boss. Why do I need to bank my money? <laughs> I'm, I'm good. Alright, so if I were to take one down, I think Rampage would be the fastest way to do it. 
to remove the reflect one. Does the Tomi need to guard since she has weak point? Oh, did she get it? Yeah, probably. That's smart. And we'll just mag combo for the other half of that one. <clears throat> okay, magic is on the table again. Oh wow, weak point just keeps going, huh? Ooh. Alright, uh, we'll counter. And, yeah, this is the weak point one. This is the MP draining one. This is the counter one. I kind of want to get this one out of the way, too. Because then we can do some AoE other stuff. But unfortunately, I think Tomi's the only one who can attack him, other than if I transform Jimmy. Which I might have to do. The weak point makes that do so much damage. Maybe weak point needs to die first. Yeah, honestly. Yeah, weak point seems like the worst one. I was hoping I could rush down and not have to deal with the counters instantly. Also, the extended, the attack thing that makes him uh, hit everybody is... Very good. Oh, I forgot I was going to go to Jimmy mode. Right. But I don't even know if that's enough. What what can we do better in this fight? <laughs> Maybe we just leave the counters for last and focus yeah. on single targeting the dangerous ones. Yeah, I think I, I agree with weak point being your highest priority because that multiplies what everything yeah. else is doing. Yeah. We might just not have the luxury of setting up AoE because we're just going to run out of time and die. Yeah. Yeah, we need to deal with the other ones. The, the ones that are having a more direct on the field effect. A can live because it's not that big a deal. Yeah, the drain is pretty small. And as is the alert. Alright, so weak point is E. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and Lars hopefully can take this one. Yeah, we'll just make sure this thing is done. Nice. Alright. Okay, no more weak points the whole fight. Good. Yeah. I guess extended is next. Yes. Yes. Because that is a huge boost to his turn economy. That's the big thing. I'm just gonna have Lars guard, honestly. Um, so extend is B? Yeah. Okay. I can do a called shot. Eh. No reason to. I can just crush. We kind of want to rush this. Oh, that one has physical counter? Why does that one have physical counter? What? Man, I wish that would show up. Because it doesn't... I didn't see that. Uh, if this fight ends up being a wash anyway, try attacking Bat A, because maybe all the ones on the left have physical counter. And all yeah. the ones on the right have magic counter. In which case, I have to be able to survive that, yeah. <clears throat> so B also has physical counter. Yeah, Jimmy might have to be a mage. Yeah. Then you lose the ability- This is hard, I don't know how to balance. Yeah. That's alright. That's that's what uh that's what I want out of this game, right? I want pretty tough fights. Alright. Maybe it has to be Jimmy mode. 
so we I, could just do both. I could just put ghost fire on Jimmy mode. Or wait, no one has reflect anymore, right? Oh no, they still have reflect, right? Just not this side. Uh, yeah, I mean, that would be a way to do it. Yeah, I don't, I don't hate this plan, actually. I think we've got some correct ideas. Yeah, if this ends up being a wash, I think we still... We know what we're doing next time. Okay, yeah, that's the plan. Alright, we have learned... We have learned the rules a little better. And that is what I was here to do. <laughs> extremely guarding, extremely guarding. Because the principal's probably going to do something crazy, because he just gathered power. Oh no, he just didn't do anything. I think he heals when it gives that message. Yeah. So this is immediately not as big of a deal anymore. Yeah. Uh. What does alert do? Uh, just immune to startle. Oh, then top left is probably the right one to kill. The the drain. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna have Jimmy work on the reflect one just so we can start doing some mayoes because it's ten a turn. It's really not that bad. Uh, That's reasonable. Yeah. Yeah, I'll just get the two reflect ones. Like, Jimmy might get low on MP, but that's super duper whatever. It's a little bummer that this resists this, but... What do you Definitely, do? Uh, We might honestly just already have it, because it just seems so non-threatening now that it's not... crits against the whole party every single turn. Yeah. Can I switch forms? Okay, I can. Cool. Uh, sadly, I can't team heal until I chalk a cola. <laughs> Damn, I might have made a single mistake. <laughs> Actually, do we even need to kill the magic reflect one? Can we just start punching the principal with physical attacks once uh, no, the top we, right one's down? Well, the bottom left, but yeah. And that's the problem, is Jimmy needs to oh. do that, because that's magic, and he's the one who needs to do that. Yeah, and I'm gonna corner pocket. And now's where the MP drain thing might start to be a big pain in the ass, actually. I can have him use it, though. Well, mm, let's get rid of the one of these dudes here. Well, mm. Chocker Cola here. Well, because Hitomi has been knocked out this whole time, her man is still there. That's weird. <laughs> That's bizarre. Okay, there's nothing to steal. I think I'm gonna smash this bat. Yeah, like, imagine how dangerous that would have been if that hit everybody. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Um. Good pep talk, Hitomi, awake. Definitely want you undulating this turn. Could alarm clock you up. Yeah, we kind of need another heal. Nope. Nice, that worked out pretty well. Alright, nice. Uh, so then between him and Hitomi, 
could be able to deal with that. Then Tanaka can just ants on a log, he dang self. Ooh, okay. Good oh, I'm dead. <laughs> that thing is starting to get annoying though, for sure. It is time for bear. <laughs> it's time for bear. I just am trying to do a million damage very quick <laughs> with the bear. Milky Way. Hope the top left doesn't have physical reflect. Uh, I mean, I killed the thing, so I don't think it does. That'd be weird. Yeah, no, we're good. Okay. All right, and that was with unmotivated too. That's wild. All right. Do I even care about the alert? <laughs> I don't think so. Well, I mean, being able to, uh, Flinch them lets you interrupt big attacks. But I don't have any ways to flinch. Done that, yeah. I just don't have a way to flinch right now, even. Uh -huh. Yeah. The bottom right is. Uh, even if you did, he doesn't have any huge telegraphed moves right now. No. Yeah, just go for him. Yeah, I'm just gonna get the team uh, juiced up a little bit so we can get a little bit of go ham going. I guess the bottom right one probably exists, so you can't just uh, flinch him every other turn while the threat of the other five are still active. Yeah. It's contributing to the fight, just the least of the six. Yeah. Alright, okay. Yeah, I guess it just... Oh, that's a big heal. Yeah. It's not that big a deal anymore, though. I need I need to get Lars able to undulate. Yo, voice of dog, thank you for the host. What up? We're uh in the middle of a uh, giving the pulsating mass, and we're uh, against a very scary principle. Wow, that does a lot of damage, though. Yeah, let's try going ham here. Let's undulate. Uh, you actually don't really need to be doing anything this turn. And attacking isn't really a thing, I just do just regular attacking. <laughs> Mad combo. It's kinda all skills or bust, right? Okay, unmotivated, unmotivated startled, that's fine. Might not be a bad idea to just guard for a bit during negative waves or whatever. A counter of Lars just in case they go for an attack. Milky Way fists. And you chalk a cola yourself.
Am I still unmotivated? Yeah. Uh, okay, then I'll head on collision and next turn I'll do the, the big one. Oh, I'm Starshine is up. I uh, can call shot for the next mag combo. Eight ball corner pocket. <laughs> okay, that heal was much worse for him. All right, rampage. Uh, yeah, just counter. In case he goes on a rampage. Guard. Mag combo is 300%. Yeah, I'll go for that. It's gonna do a lot. Yeah. Punch goes ham. Punch goes ham. <laughs> Bear goes ham. Nice. Remember when we thought I didn't have that fight? <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Catch these hams. <laughs>possessed brother is harassing the poor people. <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy, you should pick your company more carefully, young man. <laughs> First is Punk Tanaka Fellow. <laughs> Lars, why did you bring this into my home? <laughs> I think that last boss might be my favorite boss fight design wise so far. Oh really? Just because it was like, really had to evaluate what mattered most? Yeah. Oh yeah, we can equip. Okay, her armor is just really good actually. Yeah, principal fight is pretty good at being front loaded with danger. Mm -hmm. The moment you get any control of the situation, the rest of it falls into place. Mm -hmm. We still had moments where uh, we thought we had it and then a weird counter would happen. It was fun. Yeah, yeah, there was enough that it took me a couple tries to learn the rules, but as soon as I did, you know, it made sense. Her skill is fashionable. She gets access to a third trinket slot. Okay, sweet. So that's why she can equip three uh, accessories. That's a 
fun really ability. Good. Yeah, I like that. Yeah, well, I guess that's all we had to do there. Uh, so I guess we need to go to the, uh, the, the Hello Kitty building or whatever. Can you even go back to the school? Maybe. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> There's no school today. <laughs> My dude, I love Big Norm. <laughs> Slim Enormous, that would be, now that would be a good, good name. Slim Enormous. After we stole his eyes. Johnny Katana. <laughs> One, the katana is the perfect blade. My skill of it is absolute. Two, Johnny Katana is an awesome name. So cool. <laughs> I realized knives are for morons. A sword, though. <laughs> Swords are where's it's at. I'm so glad it changes their title as soon as they ask. <laughs> like he is Johnny Katana now. Man, I really hope they get to be a super boss. Yeah. Oh, they have to. Have to. <laughs> Johnny Katana and Big Norman would be a great boss fight. I'm also gonna save here just so we don't have to mash through any dialogue if, in case I eat it in this what So we have some some chat now, a chat system. Number one mascot, we can steal his costume. 
Strawberry bomb. Okay, that's okay. Nothing from that guy. Nothing from the yes man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's steal this costume first with a shakedown. Growl at everybody. Undulate just in case you know something goes wild. And let's magic bomb him. The image of the yes man crawling out of a hole in the floor. Go, oh, Lord. <laughs> yeah, just climbing out of a hole in the floor to be like, mm, yes. Okay, so that's probably HP and MP heal. God, I love this. This area's battle music is so tight. I'm so glad there are physical AoEs in this game. Oh man! Look at that! Look at that guy! I want it. You gotta get it on this one or else it's gonna die. <laughs> hey! Oh, you just found a marvelous coin too. Nice. go at this point. I mean, I got a level one. Uh oh. Literally everyone is attacking. I see this thing is a coin flip on whether or not you should attack it with one way or another. Okay. That's really clever. Yeah, I got a clean getaway. Yo, Tortuitous Conduct! What up, my dude? How's it going? Great. We've been rocking all day. All right, well, I'm fucking Seacrest out, dog. I'm <laughs> I'm up out of here, guys. Ugh. Oh, is the fountain off? Is this a fake fountain? Actually, let's uh, let's switch to sunflower skills and do comforting smile. Heal the whole team. Switch back to Buzz Dracula a bit. It's been a minute. Oh, it's frozen because the AC is broken. Right, right, right. That makes sense. Oh, I forgot to do clean getaway again. <laughs> Dang it. That's fine. <laughs> Every time you switch to Goon and it says feels kind of underemployed, it kills me. By the way, I think, it, it, was it today is the last day? Yeah. It's probably too late now, but 
Hey, you better have registered to vote, motherfucker. If you didn't, uh, check too, because there are more, um, opportunities than you would think. Which is nice. Uh, a lot of them have late voting registration stuff, so if you did goof it up, at least check and see if you can amend goofing it up. Voting is fucking, it's important. <laughs> it's important. Do it. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> When the people lose interest in participation in government, dictatorial policies are able to take hold. I cannot stress this enough. Go fucking vote. <laughs> yeah, some states have extended voter reg. Yeah. Short term vote. Medium term, do everything you can to make voting easier for yourself and everyone else. Long term, make voting mandatory. Yeah. Make voting a holiday. Yeah, voting really should just be a national make holiday. Make it required for everyone to go out and vote, and then also you get free sausage or other appropriate snack in response oh, to God, voting. Oh, God, yeah. Oh, man, if you could just go get free pizza for your whole family if you went and voted, man. People would vote their fucking asses off. <laughs> this is my democracy pretzel. Hey, I am a citizen. It's a free holiday, and if you go to where the voting happens, you get fucking three slices of pizza per family member. Bring as many as you want. We don't give a shit. We're the government. Fucking vote. Also, yes, that thing I said, that's part of Australian voting. It's <laughs> mandatory, and there are snacks. Give me my voting slice. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Lars is extremely that guy. Do not get Lars started on the lore. Do not get don't. Lars started on fucking Do lore. not. Please, no. Don't make me mash more through this lore. My family is dying. <laughs> Punch Tanaka is a treasure. Oh, alright. Level 2. Is that good? I can't help but notice there's a lot of gestating. You know, all of it. <laughs> I want my choice not to vote recognized, then go and vote for no one. But you still have to show up and go fucking punch the card, you dick. <laughs> if you want to abstain, you have to go and say, I abstain and mark down abstained. <laughs> How about that? <laughs> then you still get to not vote and you don't get to be a lazy piece of shit. <laughs> A very handsome man. Every single state should have mail-in ballots, period. Yeah. Town is village? 50240. <laughs> Dr. Ty Orpheus Tuesday, I'm disappointed in you. <laughs> you you know better than lore. this. You have to respect the law. I lore. will never respect lore. Please. Uh, we've done... I think we just started at the top and went down. Also, I forgot what the passcode was. Chat, what was the passcode? 50240. Thanks. I just grabbed the pen and wrote it down. Yeah, I usually, I mean, I still literally have the pen and notepad right here. I just didn't do it. <laughs> That's the worst part. <laughs> hey, Bazinga. Oh, nice. Ooh. 
Is that like really high level magic? Normal attack recharges 20% MP. Damn. Economy. Yeah, that could be really useful in certain situations. And that would have been really good on mom. Yeah. Mom or dad, I mean, dad would lose a bunch of magic attack, but like being able to just say, I would like to have more magic attack would be pretty tight. I don't think I have anyone who can give MP to other people though. I think that was only, uh, bear. <laughs> I think that was bear. And for what that's worth, uh, we have not been playing Jimmy the whole time. We did like two hours of DBZ, uh, a little over two hours of Jimmy, and then uh, an hour of the sponsored stuff, which was quite good. And then we hopped back to Jimmy. I'm actually probably going to play more of that sponsored stuff pretty shortly. <laughs> probably after I'm done streaming, I'm just going to go chill out and do some stuff in Assassin's Creed. That game seems chill, actually, pretty good. Where was there a level two that I hadn't gone through? I thought there was one over here. Oh, Vampire has MP gift. Yeah, the power of friendship is the one that I really, really want. Because then I could put that on like Lars and have Lars, instead of attacking, just restore everyone's MP. Be wild good. You're just gonna fly around as a bird, aren't you? Fuck you, you're not my dad. <laughs> I'll fly around as a bird if I fucking want. You can't stop me. <laughs> the game explicitly has fly around as a bird and look at stuff mode. And that's my favorite mode. Damn. Hmm. What haven't we done? I have no idea. I've lost track of the floors. Yeah, same. This was the password guy, maybe. No. This was the first tube room. This room with bean in tube. Uh, we just checked the bottom floor. I'm going top down. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just going backwards. There it is. Ah, uh, they tried to make real Pokemon. <laughs> I just wanted to make Hello Kitty <laughs> and be cool. I'm stealing snacks, and then we're leaving. <laughs> yes, man agrees. <laughs> Mart. All right, let's see what a motivated bear scream with plus 50% damage looks like. Yes, bear. Yes, bear. <laughs> it's bear time. And a motivated roughhouse from Punch. Jesus, Punch. Jesus, you told me. Bear. Time to go ham. Okay, so now we have level 3, which I think there was a door on 91. I think it was this one that was a level 3, no that was a level 4.
feel like I saw at least two level three doors. <laughs> one is probably for a treasure, and one is probably for uh, for progress. <laughs> There it is. It's been a minute. Smart. Okay, they're just informing me. It is buck time. <laughs> no, it's cool if you have to kill Buck, I understand. He is very powerful. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna save because if this is immediately the boss fight, I wanna go do the fixing the AC thing first so we get access to the fountain. I have a feeling that's a thing. Why did it, it see, I swear to God, it thinks my hand is a face sometimes. It's the worst. <laughs> okay. Alright, brother fight. I'm kinda interested to see exactly how bad our brother fucks us up. <laughs> if he is in fact just going to be a billion damage. Buck's got rad music. Yeah. I've seen enough of how powerful he is normally, and now he's in meat mode. Yeah. He's a lot of health. That he that is oh that's true at the very least. There's a lot of protein in the pulsating mass. Yeah, I'm glad also that he gets his yeah, it's his mixtape. It's his punching guys mixtape, basically. Also, it seems like he very much is a physical damage man. So I'm gonna let, uh, Mars counter. Oh man, he startled me out of the called shot. Oh, that sucks. Blue mag combo. I think after this turn, I'm gonna switch Jimmy to, uh, oh boy. Oh. Lars and Jimmy are heartbroken. What does that do? Oh, we just can't attack. They can't attack. They can't fight Buck. Fuck. <laughs> oh, that hurts. That he can just do that. That seems about right. That seems like Buck damage. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Escape. Thank you for two month resubbing. What up? How's it going? He's got a lot of health, is one thing. Okay, I'm not sure if he's gonna do an AoE or not, so I'm just gonna full guard. Cool. And that, my friends, is why we made Lars do Metabolize. Alright, we'll call shot and hope I don't get interrupted. Uh, that's concerning. I do not like the idea of my powerful brother with wings. <laughs> Is that gonna make my attack with? No, but that will. Give me the counter.
Oh no, Lars doesn't have target. Oh no, but if he eats the whole thing, he might just die. Uh oh. <laughs> Good thing I blocked. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> that was so much damage. Okay, yeah, it looks like I can only hit him with magic when he's out there. I wonder if there's any way to bring him back down. Doesn't really seem like it. Might just be the type of fight where he goes between like a magic form and a physical form. <laughs> yeah. Okay, he's back. He just had to do a big... He had to do a super attack, <laughs> and then he could come down. That tracks. <laughs> oh no, they skipped my healer because he's heartbroken. That's really bad. That was a really bad time for that to happen. I'll buy another nutrition cube. <laughs> I'll be able to get another one. Thank you, Lars. <laughs> Thank you, Lars, for being a good tank. All right, it's time to do metabolize. for a turn. See if we get lucky. Oh, this guy has way too much health, though. Yeah, dog, I came into this fight, like, not prepared at all is the other thing. Uh... But I'm not surprised if I get blown up by Buck. He just has a ton, a ton of health. Holy shit. Yeah, it doesn't even seem like it's really that gimmicky of a fight besides the uh, flight evade. Yeah. He just does a lot of damage and has a lot of HP. Has a lot of, yeah, he's just, he's fucking tough. Yeah, he, he's strong as hell. That's it. That's okay. Uh, I saved right before this for a good reason. It really fits with uh, Buck's whole character, though. Yeah, that he's that's not powered. the type of fight. Yeah. Yeah, the only thing he needed was to be. He just got wings. That's it. Other than that, he's basically still just bug. <laughs> <laughs> well, and he can do that. Well, couldn't he always kind of just blast you with negative energy? Yeah, yeah. Though we called it roasting nuts back in the day. <laughs> But yeah, I'll just load uh, from where we were before this. And uh, that actually puts us at right about the correct time to switch to final game of the night. <laughs> just a little bit of a DBFZ to close the night out. Probably do a little bit of ranked. Who knows, maybe I get better as I get more exhausted. My brain just has to work more on reflex. <laughs> <laughs> and then yeah we had our save right there i think we should be loading yeah right in front of it okay perfect